Changing it all again. Changing it all again. The final time. Until we need to expand. Oh, yeah. That's right. Yeah, final, final time. Final until, like, my son starts to walk. And expansions. Real expansions. Oh, yeah, yeah. We'll wait until expansions. It's all gonna be different. Just wait and see. Oh, space is all changing. Progress. We're still not finished with day one, but most of the tables are gone. Except for maybe two. <laughs> nope, this is the progress of the soon to be only tournament space. Moving everything that was here over to the larger space. So this is the current standing of the console side. Not much seemed to have changed except for we moved everything here from the middle of what will now be the tabletop room. Which has now been gutted. <laughs> and we got this, almost all the tables here. I'm so proud you're taking over the proper job of vlogging. <laughs> I'm terrible at it. So yes, we have every single one of our tabletop tables here, except for the extremely big one, which we still need to bring over tonight. We like to call her Big Bertha. Most of the CRTs are now out. This will be become the new tabletop shelving. And this eventually will be what the new theater room will from the other store is. So here is the current progress of the old store. So obviously we got all the tables out except for the largest one. We're starting to get all the shelving finally out so this way we can put all the merchandise. All of our new Warhammer merch. Slowly getting transferred. No Warhammer armies. One donated. The other one's ours. Going into a little case. <laughs> Obviously, we, we started to get all the collectibles out now that everything else is clear. The home theater room we're saving kind of for last. Just because it's going to be a little easier to move when everything else is clear. One of the tables of collectibles from the other case. The Pit Boy, the Batmobile, the Play Arts Harley, Griff Ball from Red vs. Blue. Now we gotta get these collectibles out. All of our manga and books are completely packed up. We're slowly getting all the board games over and slowly bringing all the extra CRTs we have right now all over to the space and there's the last table we need to grab but we're waiting until a little later later that'll be great so this is what we are now at we are very messy but we are open because tabletop at least it's an easy thing to set up. Just about time. Yeah. We don't have the product up yet, but we're working on that slowly. We got all the product in our boxes. <laughs> our counters, eh, semi set up. But. We just moved the old register 
So we can now check people in on the other side. And we're keeping these lights off so people don't see the atrocity that is this section because the back here is very, very messy. So it's currently Wednesday, day three of renovations. Again, you know, seems, this seems to be a common theme with me. Um, but I'm here by myself right now. It's currently around lunchtime. I did get in here a few hours ago. Um, began the process of organizing the small trinkets, the little office items, the small things. Um, just to start getting that stuff out of the way because a lot of small stuff, you know, adds up to big piles and a big mess. So try and get the little stuff out of the way so we can go ahead and get the big stuff in there. But... There's a lot there's a lot more than I thought there was and they're scattered throughout the entire store because there's stuff on the other side as well that I totally forgot about so kind of sucks because I have to move a lot of big furniture pieces right now and it's kind of you know a little annoying but it's a daunting task because we essentially need to get this space done by tomorrow um, the goal is to get at least the tabletop stuff done by tomorrow because I'm gonna need at least a couple days to work on the concert room side and everything. So, Ugh. so much stuff. I really gotta stop doing this to us because it's very draining, and a lot of us are very drained just from the last two days. So, Ugh. but needless to say, I'm waiting for my Chinese food right now. Gotta wait, you know. Gotta feed myself because I didn't really eat. I didn't pre. I didn't really eat last night or this morning. So, gotta eat, and obviously, you guys see we gotta get this done. The challenge today is going to see whether we can fit these guys through that archway. So what's what's really scaring me is they're both exactly 82 inches tall. So technically speaking, it should just grind. The monster fridge here is gonna be fine because it doesn't really have anything, it's flat on top, but the Coke fridge has these little hinges up top that may end up scraping the top of the thing, so. We're going to find out to see if this is going to work or not. <laughs> so I'm going to wait for a couple of the guys to come in later and then we'll get going on this. So back to work. Progress. The start of the PC console room. <laughs> Finally got those things are really nice. Kevin's been helping me personally. Like my personal assistant. Still got to move the case as we need it. <laughs> we got the the food shelves and the soda fridges. This place is still a mess, but it's a lot more organized than it was. Most of the counter is put back together. There's some serious organization need to be done. We are about to move the console stands just to bring them to the other room. So that'll be a fun little project. So yeah, check back later. It's starting to look like a store. Sort of. <laughs> we got, we moved those things. That, so I don't know if, I don't know how much Darius shot, but this morning I mentioned how that might be a problem. So those hinges ended up being a problem. So we took it out and literally, like not even, I don't even think a millimeter, it just, slid under that passageway so we got pretty lucky there but we have some couple people in here right now playing back there now that I'm seeing I, got, I, I still have to remove these things <laughs> those are decorations from my baby shower a month ago now <laughs> um, but the retail corner is starting to take shape yeah these guys have been hustling hustling very hard but it's coming together we have our what is it? There you go. Our stainless steel prep station now. Waiting for our second tail that's coming tomorrow. Eventually we'll get a sink in there and... Yeah. I don't know what else. These guys are eating. It reminds me, I probably should eat. You know? What's nice about these renovations is I lose weight, but it's because I just forget to eat during that. I'm not that's losing really weight. Bad. I'm gaining it right back from the fast food. You're just a fat pig. That's what I he has a metabolism like my wife. It's ridiculous. Look, he's literally eating margarine out of the freaking container. He's just eating the margarine. Ugh. Either way, we got a couple, we just got 
we still got a lot to do in the next two days, but now it's more like once a couple more big things left, but it's gonna be more organizing now. So it's coming together. Will we get done by the weekend? Find out. Luke has crashed! No! We're back at the old store. And there's like a few things here. At all. There are a few things we need to move anymore. Got all the shelves out. Getting these out next. Have all the paper craft ships that we had down. But they're awesome. Next we get the rest of the home theater system out. It'll be great. Check back later. It's day four. Morale's hit an all-time low. We're all dying and screaming inside. Just kidding. But right now, we've made a bit more progress when it comes to each side. This one needs just made basically all the stands moved, all the actual monitors need to be replaced because we are switching out BenQs with the ASUS monitors because the BenQs have better colors for the actual BCs. Couches still need to be put into place, but with the table room we made a lot more progress. Most of the actual product is up. Andrew's been hard at work getting all that taken care of so it's sorted properly. The tables still need to move, be moved around a lot. But our actual media library that people can enjoy is for the most part up and running. The board games still need to be sorted out a little bit because we have the large shelf for larger games and then we still need to put up the proper shelves for the small games here. And of course, we need to get the Warhammer table up. We have the ships finally here from the other space. We still need to get those hung up from the ceiling and replace all the Disney stuff from Andrew's little baby shower that we had here. And all the home theater stuff is where it should be. We just need to get the actual TV plugged in, which we still need to grab the cord for, but we are getting there. So hopefully tomorrow we'll have a lot more done and it's just little things that need finish. Welcome to day five of renovations. We are currently not done. We are far from it. <laughs> um, obviously I was being overly optimistic and thinking that we can get this done in five days. Um, but that was really pushing realistically. This is going to take us at least two weeks um, But we did get a lot done. I mean, well, this isn't done at all, but this this room still needs to get set um, It's not easy running many stores um, You know, you might think it's easy to move but the worst part of moving is actually unpacking and orga reorganizing the new space so that's what pretty much a lot of times being devoted towards and You know, it's Friday. We're gonna be open today So our, we're gonna do our best to at least open this space back up so we can go ahead and at least get table games going and throughout the night and this weekend we'll go ahead and do the little minor things to straighten this place out. But none, needless to say though, this place is starting to take some, you know, it's starting to take form, it's starting to really get there, it's starting to really show what I was hoping it would. You know, it's not quite there yet, but we're almost there. Um, so with that said, I'm going to get back to work. There's a lot to do. We're, we open in a few hours, so we have a lot to get changed here. Um, but hopefully, we'll get through tonight. We are here in the courts of the lamps. To bring you a day five update. So right now it is Friday of everything that is going on and we didn't hit our goal to have both sections open. We have the console area kind of down for another day along with the PCs. But we actually did get some work done where we moved the shelves, we got the large display shelf for the rare games. Finally in here, we're gonna have a little merch shelf for all the t-shirts and everything. Counter's still a mess. But this front section is finally looking in. So we have our magic single row finally up. All our merch is kind of on the wall now. 
sectioned off two tables, but we are just kind of completely rearranging all the tables still. So it looks very different from yesterday already. We have cubbies for everybody just to put whatever they have on them so they're not holding it. We're gonna have some charging outlets. So people that have their phones or anything like that. And then our home theater section is still a mess. Yeah, but it's coming along. It's slow, but it is coming along. So I guess check back either later tonight or tomorrow. Okay guys, here we go. It's the last update to the layout of the store. We basically have all the base layout completely done. We're in full operation. We just have little things like posters and whatnot that have to go up. Now I know it's been about a week and a half since I've really put out any type of update, but it's good. Everything is as it should be. Now we've changed up the tabletops a little bit that you've seen from the videos right before this. We even changed up the layout a little bit of the board games. We now have the home theater room up and running too. Obviously right now the TV is off because we are after hours. So this is the tabletop section. It looks very nice in my opinion. So far the feedback has been very good. You know, it's always about the feedback for us. Food section. Singles. And look, we got our Halloween decorations starting to go up. Because we are having our Halloween party this Saturday. And then here is the console room. Nice little stations for everybody. Couches that are comfortable. Have all the PCs in a row. Tracer here right in the middle, breaking 5v5. Great for any type of team competitive matches. Now back here we have kind of the bigger TVs. So we don't have any more couches, sadly. We have one one-on-one -on -one stations for when we still have our tournaments on the weekends. And a large HD TV. And then back here, this is kind of a room that transforms as we need it. Like when we have tournament setups, this is great for people that just wanna practice or they just wanna run small setups by themselves. We've also had people that have had birthday parties and come back here. Now there's something I wanted to talk about and that's more of what's gonna happen to this channel. So starting this week, we are finally going to start getting the channel 100% up and running. Now this means that we're going to be putting up vlogs. Anytime we get something cool or just anything fun happening within the store, um, I'm going to try to my best to actually film it. Try to really just immerse you guys into everything. So this weekend we actually have the Final Fantasy trading card game coming out. We have our Halloween party. And even, you know, some game releases or some new things that are coming in for the display. So I'm going to try to, I'm going to try to tape those and We'll see how the how you guys react. So definitely let us know. Stay tuned. Hit that subscribe button, especially if you want to follow along. And we'll see you guys.